Hello, this is the R Studio environment. On the bottom left hand side in the R Studio, what we have is the console. This is the work area where scripts get implemented. But we can also write directly into the console. For example, I can say 2 plus 3 and press return, and what we'll see is that uh, we get 5. However, up in the script area I could equally write 4 plus 5 say and you'll see nothing happens it's not uh, implemented it won't give us our number until we highlight it and we press uh, here and what we see down in the console area is 4 plus 5 is equal to 9. These two areas show the global environment here on the upper right hand side. This is where variables are defined and also data read. And here is an area down here for plotting. So let me show you how this works. Uh, what I'm going to do is in the script alone say x gets 1 to 10. And by that I mean that x is a list of numbers, strictly a vector uh, of numbers going all the way from 1 to 10. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Now when I run this, what happens down below is that x gets set 1 to 10. And now we know here in the global environment that x is between 1 and 10. I can also say here what is x. It's not implemented until I run and then we'll see x through here. Now let's say uh, for example that y gets, this is the assignment statement, let's say 21 to 30. I can also run that and what we'll see first of all uh, it applying down here in the console secondly the global environment showing these numbers and now what we can do is write a final bit of code so plot x comma y and we can see how this bit of code runs now and what you'll see here is that uh, the instructions have been implemented but also down here on the right hand side we have our plot of x against y. So overall we have scripts being written, we have the console area where the script is interpreted and over here are the helpful reminders in terms of the variables that we have defined and also depicting any graphs that we might have. This is the RStudio environment.